वेदांतु and let's start the session <clears throat> now as you know this is a new kind of uh, examination so this time if you require any assistance any uh, help uh, any guidance you require i would suggest vedantus pro subscription a very good deal for all of you so first thing guys what are the features which you will be getting under vedantus pro subscription is the first thing you will be getting unlimited live classes you can attend as many classes as you want there is no limit on that all the classes are going to be filled with fun and high level quizzes next is you'll be able to compete with the students from the different parts of the world so you'll get to know where do you actually stand also the replays will be made available to you once the class is over and even while watching the replay also guys you'll be able to attend the quizzes and see your name in the leaderboard so the replay also is going to be an interactive replay also you'll be getting notes in the handwriting of mass teachers test assignments all will be provided at one place so you don't have to go for thousands of places all right everything at one single place and also <clears throat> in class we'll be having a dedicated teacher just to take care of your doubts we call them class teachers so class teachers will make sure that each and every doubt of yours will be resolved and other than that there are unlimited micro courses and crash courses free for all of you once you have become a pro student and with the help of these you can study a topic as many times as you want you can revise a topic as many times as you want and also you can meet your different teachers favorite teachers as well and attend their classes all right so guys it's very easy to register the link is mentioned in the description box of this video as well as in the pinned comment and the coupon code is gpe pro which will give you directly 10% off all right so i'll show you in detail how do you uh, register for this but first let's start with our session so what are the five steps with which you can easily prepare for uh, prepare for your mcq examination the first thing is repetition or uh, understand this <coughs> is as when you are doing the questions now when you are practicing any assignment or when you are practicing uh, from your practice book for a different chapter try to understand guys that suppose if a exercise of any chapter uh, say polynomials uh, say has 100 questions right now it is not necessary to for you to solve all those 100 questions all right you need to first be thorough with your concept and then you need to understand that if the questions are of the same type where only the values are changing but the concept is same you can skip those questions because one like <clears throat> right now if you have time you can do it but i would suggest rather than doing all the 100 questions just see whether the question are of the same type you can just see that okay this is how the question will be solved you can solve it in your mind say <clears throat> i ask you alpha plus beta value so you saw the equation is given some of the roots is asked you saw the quadratic equation is given coefficient of x is known coefficient of x square is known you directly can get the answer so no need to solve it again and again right minus b upon a you can do it so that's what you need to understand that if the questions are repeating skip them and focus on new kinds of question okay so this is going to <clears throat> make your uh, say completing the syllabus very quick because if you start solving 100 questions definitely each and every chapter is going to take a lot of time okay so focus more on your concepts if a question is repeating with the same concept you can skip that you know it's just the changing of the values you have understood that question try to solve different types of question based on different concepts if suppose a question is asked in a different way try to try to solve those kind of questions that will definitely help you all right so avoid solving same types of question again and again and again just to make yourself feel good ki are you are able to solve if you are able to solve same types of question that means you have learned only one type try to solve different types of question next is keywords remember guys in any mcq any multiple choice question the main thing is the keywords because as you all know now earlier you used to have one mark question two marks question three marks five marks so question were of different uh, say were carrying different weightage but this time all the questions will be carrying same weightage so this time you'll be needing uh, you'll be needed to solve more questions 
in the same time you need to solve more questions and definitely for that purpose guys you need to understand when you are reading a question what are the keywords which words will tell you what the question is about for example if you are reading a question and you saw find the sum of the roots you got to know that it is about alpha plus beta equal to minus b by a when you are reading a question and you found out that what is the degree so you got to know okay so degree is the main word over here so this way understand the keywords read the question carefully and focus on the keywords because if you miss any single key uh, keyword remember guys options are set in that way that you will definitely mark a wrong answer it's not like he, they'll only put correct answer and the remaining ones they just make any value appear over there no they know what question what mistake student can make and when you make come when you do that mistake what your answer will be that also will be one of the options over there so even if you are getting the if in, even if you are doing the wrong solution a uh, highly probability whatever answer you'll get that will be in the uh, options because examiner set the question like that for example uh, say i give you find the value of sum of the roots and say the value of sum of the roots came as 1 by 2 when you use minus b upon a examiner will intentionally put minus 1 by 2 also in the option because they know some of the students will forget minus b by a they'll directly write b by a and they'll get minus 1 by 2 as their answer so be very aware about the keywords if you get all the keywords correct you understand the question properly definitely you'll get the correct answer third is mind map use mind map to remember the formulas to remember the key concepts remember the details uh, whenever you are solving a question which steps are really important those kind of uh, mind maps can definitely be useful for all of you okay <clears throat> now this is a very important point set a timer what do i mean by this is guys see you saw that uh, to solve an mcq so start giving yourself test say 20 questions you pick and try to complete that in say 30 minutes or something okay and see with what speed you are solving if you have a book of sample paper try to give that sample paper to yourself as a test and see whether you are able to complete all the questions and it should not be like when the time is about to end that time you are able to complete all the questions because you have to recheck the answers one more time also when you will be doing the sample papers with the timer you will get to know that if you get stuck at a question in how much time you should leave it because if you will directly go for exam high probability that when you'll get in a get stuck in a question you'll keep on solving that and you'll easily waste 10 to 15 ma uh, 10 to 15 minutes only for a single question and that you cannot do you need to learn which questions you need to skip first all right that's very important competitive examinations mcq preparation student should know ki which questions to attempt and which questions to not attempt because all questions carry equal weightage so understand guys if you get stuck in some question if you think a question is difficult keep it for the end first solve all the easy and medium questions so that you can get your maximum marks all right and that practice you'll only be able to develop when you give mock test give yourself test set a timer complete the questions in the given amount of time trust me guys those who will be listening to this advice you see you will definitely see a increase of 10 to 15 marks definitely but if you are not listening to this even if you are preparing really very good without mock test definitely it will reduce your 5 marks this is the most important step out of all these five so no matter how confident you are about your studies please don't forget to give at least three or four mock test definitely do that all right and the last one test yourself which i have told you a mock test you need to do make self timer so that you can complete the questions in the given amount of time see where you are making mistakes focus on those <coughs> areas whichever subject is difficult for you focus on those subjects as well because ultimately at the end all the subjects marks will will decide who is the topper right so uh, test yourself as well mock test is a very important thing all right so these are the five things guys and remember to become a master at any skill it takes the total effort of your heart mind and soul working together in tandem right so understand this thing guys if you want to master over your subjects it will require dedication it cannot be like you just with sitting or without practicing you will be mastering any subject no all right there is no substitution for hard work all right always remember smart work is not a substitution for hard work 
हार्ड वर्क इज ऑलवेज देर वेन यू डू अ लॉट ऑफ हार्ड वर्क दैट इवेंचुअली टेल्स यू हाउ टू डू दिस स्मार्टली ओके सो अंडरस्टैंड दिस थिंग्स ऑल एट गाइज नाउ दीज वर माई फाइव टिप्स आउट ऑफ विच आई है मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग इज अटेम्प्ट मॉक टेस्ट ऑल राइट so guys you can register for vedantus pro subscription if you if you need any guidance any help in your preparation and also you are getting gp pro as well so and you'll be getting 10 percentage off with this code and the best thing is there are very good courses one of those is say grade 10th term 1 crash course if you want to see how to register for it you can just go to the description box of this video and go to this link <coughs> avail all exciting vedantu courses here you can see term 1 crash course Once you click on this term one crash course, here you will find out Pro Light and Pro Plus. Sorry, Pro Classic. You can see, guys, uh, the price difference is not too much. I would definitely suggest Pro Classic because during this last month, if you get access to Doubts app, your or any doubt you're getting, click the photo, get the solution. So that's going to be very handy. It's going to be very helpful for all of you. If you want to go for the year-long course as well, definitely you can go over here. For Vedantus Term One, Term Two, year-long course, and this is the price for year-long courses over here. You can see Pro Light, Pro Classic, and Pro Plus, and in this EMI option is also available for you, है ना? And these courses definitely is going to say improve your marks and your query you have. Guys, don't forget to uh, go through the frequently asked questions mentioned below. And one more thing, guys, that when you take this course, it's not like we'll complete your syllabus only once. your syllabus you can complete as many times as you want because you'll be getting unlimited micro courses so study a topic as many times as you want all right so this is all guys you can see the term one crash course uh, start the the courses when one course has already started on 27th september if you will register now you can join that batch as well as one is starting on 11th october take the course now join it for 11th october and in between you can start with your micro courses as well as well as here year long courses as well there are other courses as well for icsc student maharashtra board students foundation courses if you want to prepare for je and neet you can start your preparation now one more uh, one more batch is opening for foundation courses and then there are ntsc crash course available as well <clears throat> all right guys so this is all from my side in today's class thank you so much for joining the session i hope all of you enjoyed this and you'll not forget the thing to take mock test with a timer All right so thank you so much guys i hope all of you enjoyed it please don't forget to like this video share it with your friends and subscribe to this channel if you are new here i'll see you soon bye bye sayonara khuda hafiz to all of you bye bye